yes, my guys, we are at Walmart, the physical media beacon of the entire world. I am so pumped to get in here and pick up the steel book for Hannibal Rising. Everyone knows that is probably the best Hannibal movie. Thank God. Let's check out the new release. There's probably not going to be anything good here. The deal with Stranger Things Chapter 1. If you haven't seen that, it's honestly better than the original. I'd pick up that Blu-ray with the slip while you still can. I wouldn't bother with the steel book. I honestly hate steel books, which is why you're probably like, going, well, Steve, why the heck are you going in there get Hannibal Rising on Steelbook? Yeah, it's just that's a really good movie and it hasn't gotten the recognition it deserves. So I need to get like this because, you know, if, you know, boutique companies see like the Steelbook sells well, they're probably gonna be like, you know, we need to get a 4K of a slipcover out there and then I can just throw that Steelbook right in the trash. But, you know, if it never happens, then hey, I still got a ultra rare Steelbook, you know, it'll go rusty, but I can sell it before it gets too bad. Um, but yeah, Walmart just has the same crap. It's, it's crazy. I haven't been here in like a month and look at this. It's like the same Netflix crap, same movies, Twister, you know, on 4K with the slipcover still here. Oh, you know, I just, I don't, I don't get it. Um, I'm not seeing any Halloween stuff yet. I'm just kind of seeing a bunch of dumb DVD box sets. Uh, I, I don't even like know what to tell you here. Like, I really just came to get Hannibal. You know, it's just like you know, I'll record while I'm here. Everyone wants to hear what I have to say about Walmart, but I just want Hannibal Rising. You know, uh, I'm just kind of sick of Walmart's crap. I really don't go in here very much anymore. But you know, look at that. They got the kids section, still just the same nonsense, still the same crap. Then you got your juvenile anime section for all of like the you know. 13 year old boys and girls then we've got the boy disgusting section it's been pretty picked over there's not a lot of good left you do have a couple of rob zombie action figures up there so that's pretty sick um then you got that toxy thing no one really cares about that ghost face is pretty cool though um they've changed up a little bit over here by change up i mean they've had some more junky dvds uh again you know that's the problem with this section. Like, I know some people get, like, pumped to get into the Walmart physical media section, but it's just, like, it's all DVDs. I don't know. I don't get it. They probably have discs up before you even buy them, you know? And a lot of times the same DVDs. Just, like, I've been looking at this place for, like, five months, and I swear it's just the same crap, you know? Like, I think that, that dorky Dexter's Lab crap is new, but finally, here we are. Wait, what? There is not a single... Steelbook, you know, I've been emailing them for a long time saying, get rid of your steelbooks. But what? What? They finally do it on the day I actually want to buy one? But look, look, like the bloody disgusting ones are supposed to be here. This tag here is for Hannibal. Where are they? I'm, look, and they've even got DVDs on here. This is Steelbook, movies wrapped in metal. Those are DVDs wrapped in stupid plastic. I'm, absolutely flabbergasted you know that a billion dollar corporation could care this much or rather not care this much about their customers you know i came out of my way came out of my huge house slash apartment left the cat behind just so i could you know pick up some sick you know vintage media you know I don't see it here. I just see some games. You know, did they, did they decide they're going to move it? They're going to get rid of the video games and expand the movie section because that's where, you know, the money's at. Like, all I see is games. And I don't even see any deals. I, I don't even know what to say. I guess I'm going to have to come back in like a week or so and see if they've taken care of this problem because this is honestly embarrassing. You know, I, can't believe that a company this large would let just millions and millions of people down people that need to know what i think it's not here they still got stupid printers who's printing out stuff in 2024 i oh well at least there's this